guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Block Tech Tips. And of course, guys, you can see here we have the Dizionans again, the stars of the show. And this time I'm having a, I had an issue that I fixed with this that I would like to share with you guys. As you can see here, guys, this is my personal DZ09. It's a new one. And this is my friend's DZ09 that was not working. He has had this for a while. It's one of the older models. However, his was not charging as it should. Now, if this is happening to you, I'm going to show you what you can do to actually fix the problem. Of course, this device is fixed now and it charges fine. Now, one of the things I notice is that most likely this is an older device and I think he had it um, put down for a while. But of course, if yours is not powering on and the issue he was having is that it's not powering on and it was not charging. It was not simply not taking a charge. And what we did was simply just to, um, we went ahead and removed the buck and that was quite easy to simply find the area here or the um, area with the indentation. And what I did was to pop off the buck or to remove the buck. Once I did that, I simply removed the battery. All right. And what I, once I did that, guys, and removed the battery from the device, the next thing I did, guys, was to take my device, which was at the time, was to take my device, which at the time was this one, which was working fine and what I did was to take my battery out of the working unit and I simply place it into his version once I did that I powered up the device which was the older one and it powered up and I'm just explaining what I did on how to fix it hope it works for you and once I did that it powered up so that proved to me that this device was actually working fine and the issue was related to the battery next I took the battery which was um, not charging, not doing anything, and I placed it into mine. And what I once I did that, guys, I just simply got my um, charger, and I hooked it up. Once I connected and hooked it up, I plugged it in, and after a while, I noticed that it started to charge. And this is the key part, guys. It wasn't charging in, in his device, and basically, once I did it in mine, it started to charge. And next, what I recommend that you do is that after I start charging, give allow it to charge for at least about three to five minutes or even a little bit longer and once i did that i stopped it i unplugged it i removed the battery once again and what i did was to place it back into its original device as you're seeing here once i did that guys i simply just got the back and i simply snapped it back into place and once i did that i just powered up the device and voila it actually powered up at the time and next i just simply connected the charger and it was charging now the trick here was to just get a little juice from the working device into this one started to pour it up then simply charge and from then it has been charging perfectly this might happen to you in cases where you left the device for a very extended period without um, pouring up or maybe just start to happen where it does not charging and not pouring on any at all and of course guys there are other fixes i'll put those on screen Another one that I recommend, guys, is that you um, check the battery. Sometimes it's not being um, making perfect contact. Simply get a piece of paper, cut it into a shape, place it behind the battery, and simply add the cover back in place. I have a video on that. I'll link around here. And you can click on that. It shows you in detail what to do. And once you actually place the back, back on and try to power on, it might fix it. So that's the first option that I explained. And the second option, which I have a second video on. Last but not least, if all else fails, it might be a battery. You can actually pick up one of these batteries for about um, $7 on Amazon. Um, once you do that, they should work quite fine in your device. And if it's a battery issue, you can simply switch it out. Or if you have a friend with an older DZ09 and it's not working anymore, you can actually take their battery or get the battery off of them. And it should work. All right, guys? So that has been several suggestions on how to fix issues where the DZ09 smartwatch is not working as it should. So guys, if you have any of these issues, just go ahead and um, share below in the comments. If I can help, I'll try to help. Alright, so we got from Blog Tech Tips. So another set of quick tips. Saying bye until next time, guys. Bye.